What is up you guys, Blandy Games here and welcome back to my Pokemon series. We finally finished Pokemon Fire Red so we will be starting a new series now. This is my Let's Play Pokemon Emerald Part 1. Let's do this. Hi, so to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch. My one calls me the Pokemon Professor. Okay. <coughs> This is what we call a Pokemon. You don't say. This world is wildly inhabited by Pokemon creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon, at times as friendly playmates, and at times as cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many, many secrets around the Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, we've been undertaking this research. That's what I do. And you are? I am Blanny. Are you a boy or are you a girl? I'm a boy. Alright, what's your name? My name is Blanny. And I will be the one who will conquer the elite four. Once again. So it's Blanny, yes. Ah, okay. You're Blanny who's moving to my hometown of Lilywood. I get it now. All right, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon with dreams, adventure, and friendships away. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. I'm on it, Captain. Is that a truck? No way, did we get kidnapped? No. Seems like he stopped. Is that a door? Wait, before we go outside, let's make this fast. Let's go. That truck looks pretty nice, to be honest. Danny, we're here, honey. Must be tiring riding with our teens in the moving truck. Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? This is our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? Hey, you get your own room, Danny. Let's go inside. Let's go. Why did she make me ride in the back? Why couldn't I just ride in front? See, Blanny? Isn't it nice in here, too? The movie's welcome all through the work of moving us in and cleaning up after. This is also for me. It's so convenient. Blanny, your room is upstairs. Go check it out, dear. Dad brought you a new clock to mark our move here. Don't forget to set it. Let's -a go. It doesn't really matter which time I choose for the clock. I just, like, do this, move it a little bit, and go. It won't really matter, to be honest. Blanny, you like your new room? Good, everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything downstairs too. Pokemon movies are so convenient. Oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. Do we have something here? Let me put it up to the seal of you. I wonder if we'll deposit stuff in our computers. I mean, how do they even do that to us? <clears throat> oh well. Oh, Blanny, Blanny, quick, come quickly. Look, it's Battle Boy Gym. Maybe that will be on. We brought you this report from in front of Battle Boy Gym. Oh, it's so. I think that was something we missed, and too bad. Oh, yes, one of Dad's friends lives in town. Mr. Bridge is his name. He is right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. You, Mom, you can't be serious. You call me over, check on the TV to see if Dad was on TV. But you call me right when the show is over? Come on, Mom. You can do better than that. Oh, hello, here you are. Oh, you're Lani, a next door name. Hi. You have a daughter about the same age as you. I thought it was excited about making a new friend. I thought it's upstairs, I think. What do you mean, you think? What kind of mother are you? You don't even know your daughters? Is that a Pokeball? Alright, guys. The time has come for us to show our skills. There's still the Pokeball. We got cut already? <clears throat> huh? What? Oh, you're Blani. So your move was today. Uh, I'm May. Glad to meet you. I I have this dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. I I hear about you, Blanny, from my dad, Professor Birch. I was hoping that you would be nice, Blanny, and that we could be friends. Oh, isn't th isn't this? Oh my God, I messed up. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I I, I just met you, Blanny. Hey, hey, hey. Oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to go help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. Blanny, I'll catch you later. Uh, but I don't I don't want you to catch me later. 
Let's go. I don't think we gotta go to the professor lab, so what's this little girl doing here? Oh, I skipped that. They're scared Pokemon outside. I can hear their cries. I want to go see what's going on. What have a po I don't have a Pokemon either. And you're making me go outside. You're making me go out there. And you go see what's happening to me. Alright, I got you. Help, help, help me. What's up, bitch? You seriously being chased by a Sitsugun? Hello, you over there. Please help me. In my back. There's a Pokeball. What's up, bitch? Come on, man. You're a professor. Okay, so we got Touching the Fire Starter. We got Mucky, the water type Pokemon. And we got Trickle, the grass type. I'll go with Trickle. I love grass Pokemon. So I'll be choosing. Wow, see going up here. Go, Trico. All right, Trico. You know the drill. Let's show them who's boss. Pow. Come on, bitch. You're being chased by a level 2 Sitsugun. You're supposed to be a professor. You're supposed to have, like, a lot of Pokemon. What's wrong with you? I was in the tall grass turning wild Pokemon when I was jump. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Huh? Hi, you're Blanny. It's not the place to chat, so come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? So, Lanny, I heard so much about you from your father. I heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. But the way you battled earlier, you pulled it all with a goblin. I you have your father's blood in your veins, after all. Oh, yes. Just for rescuing me, I'd like you to have the Pokemon you used earlier. Lanny received the Trico! While you're at it, why not give a nickname to that Trico? Mmm. I've been thinking hard for this, so... Well, not really that hard, but... I'll name him Gecko. Yup, that's right, guys. Gecko. Gecko the Trico. If you work at Pokemon again, it's Pierce. I'll tell you're making an extremely good trick. My kid man is also saying Pokemon helping me out. Granny, you think it might be a good idea to go see me? Uh, nope. Great, make sure we have it too. Get made to teach you what it means to be a To teach me how to be a trainer? You're talking to a Pokemon master right now. Have you seen my skills? I defeated the Elite Four for Pokemon Fire Oh, guys, I might also be uploading some videos for, I mean, some other parts like extras for Pokemon Fire Reds. Even though I already finished it, but I might like do some, show how to get some legendary stuff. Since you couldn't get some due to like some events, the are on, they can only be accessible like during events. But since like there's no events going on, we had to use a cheat, a cheat code in order to be able to access it. Is that May? What's up, May? What you doing there? I'm gonna help you out. Uh, I already got tired of you, Puchiena. Uh, I think I. I think I did a, did a bad thing here attacking him. Let me use the potion. I know, guys. I know. But let's do this. Doesn't matter. We'll, we'll defeat her anyways. May is not as strong as, as us. Let's see. The Pokemon found a Ruby Hunting Tree Group. Oh, hi, Blanny. Oh, I see. My dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is like. You see, th you see this, guys? It's gonna give me a taste of how to be a trainer. Nah, mate, that doesn't work like that. I'll give you a taste on how to be a trainer. Get cool. Destroyer. Okay. Wow. Wow, guys. That critical hit. Uh. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, it's, guys, it seems like May was the one who gave us a taste. <laughs> Or how to be a Pokemon. My career is over, guys. We got destroyed by me. Oh God! Come on, me. You don't, you don't do this to us. And on our first episode, I'll just like, I'll just speed it up here. That's Th just, that's just no way that we let ourselves get destroyed by me. I'll just speed it up here. Let's go, me. I want my rematch. Let's see, we're gonna find Nah, mate, we don't, don't give me that. You you destroy us. You, like, ruin our career. And it's time for us to show you what a true trainer is like. I, I, I'm probably just pulled a Gary there and got destroyed by a toy chicken. 
Alright, alright, Torchy. You're about to get it right now. You're about to get this destruction. Wow, guys. Got destroyed in the first episode? Oh my goodness. Level 7. Yeah, I'm pretty good. <laughs> you guys saw nothing. I didn't lose or anything. I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. I mean, he just got that Pokemon where he already likes you. You might be able to defend any kind of Pokemon easily. But it's time to head back to the lab. Alright, May. I'm coming after you. Why is she so fast? She's already she already disappeared. Need to chill, May. Nani over here. Let's hurry home. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Well, guys, <clears throat> we got defeated. Right. But don't worry, guys, we got this, we got this. We're still strong. We will be the, tr we will be a Pokemon master anyways. Oh, hi, Blani. I heard you beat May on your first try. Y yeah, that's right, guys. We'll be here on our first try. That's excellent. May's been helping with my research for a long time. May has an extensive history as a trainer already. Here, Blani, I ordered this for my research, but I think you should have these Pokédex. Ooh, we finally got the Pokédex. The Pokédex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you need to catch. My kid mate goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokémon, it records his data in the Pokédex. Why? May looks for me while I'm out. The field work he shows me. Oh wow, Blani, you got a Pokédex too? That's great, just like me. I got something for you too. Ooh, we got Pokeballs. Where I put away the Pokeballs? It's fine if you can get a lot of Pokemons. I'm going to look all over the place because I want different Pokemons. If I find a cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Ah, uh, you do you. You do you, May. <coughs> Is that our mother? What's up, Mom? Wait, Blani. Blani, Blani, did you do this yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon! You got it from Professor Birch, how nice! You're your father's child, right? You look good to the honey. If you're going out on an adventure, wear these running shoes. Don't put a sip in your step. Blani switch shoes with the running shoes. Blani, those shoes came with instructions. Press the B button while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Sleep on these running shoes and race in the great outdoors. Dot dot dot. To think that you have your very own Pokemon now, your father will be overjoyed. But please be careful. <laughs> if anything happens, you can come home. Go on. Go get them, honey. Alright, mother. I'll show you what I'm made of. Because I am the ultimate Pokemon master. I already defeated the league. I defeated everyone. Well, that was the Pokemon Fire Ray, of course. But let's heal Gecko. He had a pretty hard battle destroying May. <laughs> you know, you know that we did a pretty good job destroying her. I had no problems at all. Thank you, Nice Joy, for healing our Pokemon and being there for all of us. Guys, and that concludes my first episode of Let's Play Pokemon Emerald. See you next time. In the next video. Be safe and take care.